The House of Representatives Ad Hoc Committee investigating capital project executed and funds repeated in the Appropriation Act from 2015 till date has discovered financial impropriety in the budgeting of the management of Shedda Science and Tech Complex. The committee slammed the DG Shedda Science and Tech Complex and the National Coordinator National Blood Transfusion Service for repetition of project and the unwarranted increase of the budget from 2015 to 2021. Now, financial leakages in the economy over the years have been identified as the main sources of economic losses in the country, and MDAs have been fingered as the major culprits. From the record before me here, this is where Nigeria is leaking. People are beaten out around, but see where the, the leakages are. If in 2015 you demand 20 million, in 2016 you demand 200 and something. And you should remember, and you should remember that there is MTSS. Right? The finance man, I'm talking to you. Yes. So how can you justify this your request? Even because you see that it is a bonanza, any time they give you envelope, you loop it in the same ERGP and clear it. You even have the power to request a two point something billion in 2021. The National Blood Transfusion Agency and the Shedda Science and Tech Complex gave an increased budget of 2 million in 2015 to 2.5 billion in the year 2021, same as a coordinator of blood transfusion agency who also gave his submission. In most cases, in most cases, you may discover that you will say that this particular thing, you need 20 million for it. You put 20 million there. At the time the appropriation comes out, what you may see there is 10 million. And if you see 10 million, and that is what is appropriated, there is no way you'll be able to actually execute what you had in mind. So what do you do? The following year, you repeat to be able to get enough money to complete what you want to do. The documents you have asked for, they are there. We'll, we'll bring them back to you. At least I've um, directed them, they have brought them out. You know that they didn't put the details of this, of the budget lines, the capital, the recurrent, and what was spent. They are there. And I'll make sure that they are represented to you. Um, again, we we'll also found out if there is any money that has not been released, which we are calling be rolled over, of course. I want to thank you for giving us that, that clue. The committee questioned agencies for budgeting repeated items year in, year out on the same subhead, which they say is inimical to the development of the country, as some agencies are starved of funds because of these. You to understand that on 27th April 2020, you awarded a contract to Respect Global Resources Limited on plot number 236, Aminu Kano Crescent, Hussein Abuja, at the cost of 2.4 million naira to provide face marks. On the same day, you award the same contract to Krasata Office and Homes Limited, plot 126, Aminu Kano Crescent, adjacent to Global Com, Hussein to Steel, Abuja, with the same amount, 2.4 million, same amount. So I see repetition of face masks, face masks, face masks. I don't know how many people do you have in the organization that have been using these face masks. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.